Hi everyone. I'd like to just um, do this quick video to talk to you about finding your unique star personality. We all have one, um, sometimes referred to as our star DNA, and it's a bit like Brighton Rock, it's stamped right through you. And it's not just me saying that. Um, as many of you may have heard me say before, um, style is a way of saying who you are without having to speak, my favourite ever quote from Rachel Zoe. Style is a reflection of your attitude and personality, Sean Ashmore. Style is more about being yourself, Oscar de la Renta. Okay, so some great quotes, but what do they actually mean in reality? And how do you put it into practice? Well, in simple terms, style is a way of expressing yourself. Imagine how much easier it is when you walk in a room and people get you before you're introduced. It's really important when, like me, as self-employed and you're representing your business at networking events. When I tell someone I've just met my story and the fact that I was an accountant for 19 years, their normal reaction and response is to laugh and say, but you don't look like an accountant. When you express yourself through your clothes, the benefits are enormous. It's really empowering to express your, the true version of yourself. You're showing up and being your true self. Your personality will shine through and you'll look fabulous and feel fabulous too. And once you start feeling fabulous, then your confidence soars. And who doesn't want a soaring confidence? Okay, so now you know the benefits, how do you actually go about putting it into practice? Well, the first place to start is to by looking at you. And you want to start pulling together a list of adjectives um, that describe your personality and your values. And I suggest that you get this down to between three and five. Um, if you have a longer list, then try and hone it down a bit and go with the words that really resonate with you um, and take it from there. If you're a visual thinker, then perhaps you want to think in images and you may find it better to do this online um, and maybe to do it by Pinterest or perhaps um, looking through um, hard copied magazines, that kind of thing, and pulling together a vision board. Um, whatever works for you. But if you do do it visually, you still need to be able to pull out those key phrases. When you've decided on your words, it's now time to start taking a look at your wardrobe and see if it matches up or not. And um, you can either do this by breaking it into um, function types for your wardrobe, maybe evening wear, maybe casual wear, um, or you may find it easier to do it by clothing types, say jackets, dresses, etc. Um, which is the way that I prefer to do it. So, for example, we take jackets out of the wardrobe, we lay them on a bed, and uh, we take some scraps of paper and we write down what those clothes mean in, or say to us. Um, now, it may be that not all of those words that you put down in your personality resonate, but really I would recommend doing this without reference to the words that you put down on your, as your own personality to start with. Um, it may be that some of the words resonate, um, and in which case you've got a partial match, or it may be a full match. So how do our clothes speak to us? Well, it could be through the colour, it could be through the print, the pattern, the texture of the fabric, the actual fabric itself, the cut, the shape, the style, all of those kind of things. It could be the embellishments as well. Um, it may be that you find that, as I said, you've got a partial match, and if you've got a partial match, then Perhaps you want to put it together with um, something else to see whether you get a full match. A jacket might work when you put it together with a dress or a pair of trousers, for example, to complete a full match. Or it may be, take my favourite example, it may be ju just by adding accessories really shines your, um, through your, your star personality. If you're max matching up outfits, I recommend that you take some photographs and keep these to one side because I hope that you're going to find you're going to be able to multi-purpose your um, outfits in your wardrobe and they won't just get used for um, one occasion. But you've got to start somewhere. Um, one of the points that my clients raise most frequently about this is, um, but I have a different values and personality depending on what I'm doing. Well, I'd question, do you? Because really your values and personality 
shine through you, whatever you're doing, whether it be at work, whether it be um, at a family barbecue. Uh, it may, may be that the clothing styles change a bit, but you'll still find yourself expressing um, yourself through your clothing. You'll be drawn to certain types of clothing. Um, another question I'm often asked is, does my style personality change with age? Well, again, it may be that it modifies slightly. Um, it may be that um, you find that you, know, you haven't got quite the same values that you had in your twenty you had in your twenties when you get to your forties or fifties, for example. Um, so those are really the, the points that I wanted to raise in this video, and I'd now like to really hand over to you and um, let you have a go at creating your unique style personality. And I'd love to hear how you get on. Um, but if you do find this a bit of a struggle, then um, equally I'd like to hear from you. Um, because we do cover this in Creating Wardrobe Magic, my new programme, which will also help you determine the colours that really work for you, as well as the styles that you should be wearing for your, um, for your body shape, for your proportions and for your scale. Um, I have two places left on my beta testing programme, so if you'd like to take advantage of one of those places, then I would love to hear from you. Um, and contact me um, to find out. You can email me carol at wantheroutfit.com or drop me a message in the comments below. All right, whatever um, you're doing with your style personality, do share how you get on and um, have yourselves a great day. Thank you. Take care and bye for now.